Hello everyone. In this video, we'll see how do we use zeros command in MATLAB. Uh, say I want only three zeros as an array, zero, zero, zero. This is how we define, right? If I hit enter, I get zero, zero, zero. Let's say I want 10 zeros, x is equal to, within a square bracket, I have to give 10 zeros, zero, 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 10 zeros, right? Manually, I have to type 10 zeros, but let's say I want 100 zeros. I cannot manually keep on typing zeros. So for that, we can use zeros command in MATLAB, okay? So how do we use it? X is equal to, the command is set E R O S of, within the normal bracket, uh, how many number of rows, comma number of zeros. Uh, if I hit enter, I get only one zero because in one row, in one column, I want zeros. In the sense, I get only one scalar and its value is zero. Let's say if I change this argument to two comma two, and if I hit enter, I get two rows and two column, two rows and two column, I have zero, right? Now, if I want, if I change it to 5 comma 5 or 5 comma 2, 5 rows, 2 columns, I get 0. Okay. So, there might be cases that we, you want a matrix with com, filled with completely 0. In that case, you can use this command. Let's say if I want 100 zeros in one row, so for that, x is equal to z e r o s of in one row, I want 100 zeros, 1 comma 100. So you get 100 zeros, okay? So this is how you can use zeros command in MATLAB. Thank you.